Talk about money and politics, shall we? And the two are about to collide, it seems like. Treasury is considering withdrawing half of its contingency reserves from the central bank. Now, it's planning to use the money to reduce the government's debt and also fund the public sector salaries, the wage bill, if you will. The state and the bank are close to an agreement, we understand, on a withdrawal from the 500 billion rand fund. But is this a good idea? Why is this being done? Well, let's get the view of the Democratic Alliance on money being taken from the gold and foreign exchange account. The party is Dion George uh, joining us uh, now. Uh, Dr. George, good morning to you and appreciate uh, the time. Good idea or bad idea? Good morning. I think it's a bad idea because we need to ask ourselves what that reserve is there for. Now it's a risk reserve. So what happens over time is that the bank builds up a reserve. What's supposed to happen every year is there's supposed to be a review. And that money actually does, in inverted commas, belong to the National Treasury. Because if there was a deficit, for example, they'd need to fund that. But the big question here is, why is it necessary to tap into this reserve, especially when we have a very risky environment? We know our economy is not growing, and we know that government has a spending problem, although it says it doesn't have, a, have that kind of problem, it's got, got a growth problem. So by tapping into this reserve, which is a significant amount of money, the question needs to be asked is, what is government going to be doing with this money? If they're going to be spending it on the public sector wage bill, it means that they're using it for consumption expenditure. So it's basically raiding your savings account to fund your current expenses. And that is a very bad idea.